Lockdown lifted. Go. Prison towers up ahead. Hope you're not afraid of heights. That breaks you. I can't hold you. What's wrong? Find myself. There's little time. Prisoner threat level, extremely high. Prisoner released. Ah, free at last. Pleasure to meet you. Face to face, that is. Now, let's take a look inside. This may feel a little strange. Welcome to Cyber Void. Time to fix you up. You can talk here, by the way. Who are you? You can call me Architect. Who am I? You're a ghost runner. Number 74, to be precise. That will have to do for now. Your physical body is vulnerable. Time runs slower here, but we should still hurry. Just keep moving. I will take care of your recalibration. I remember a fight. Others like me. A fall. You've been cast down from Dharma City to the base district. It's a miracle to survive a fall like that. Even for someone like you. A ghost runner. Yes. You were bodyguards, peacekeepers, arbitrators, and anything else we needed you to be. You tried to stop the coup. The name is Mara, or the Keymaster, as she calls herself now. Twenty years ago, she stood against me. It was you I was trying to save. You failed. I died. My body did anyway. Thanks to the precautions I had taken, I'm still here. Although this form has its limitations. Are you an AI? You could say that. You could also say Dharma Tower is a skyscraper. Technically correct. What is the tower then? Humanity's home. A megastructure that once housed a million. It had been under my care since its creation. Almost a century ago. I served the people, kept them safe. Maintained the shelter I provided. But Mara had her own plan. She became the sole ruler of Dharma Tower. Ruining what I've built. Bringing us back to the verge of extinction. This place be more. 
Oh, it's perfectly normal. It's you that has become incompatible. The incompetent prepares you were subjected to, made you divergent. You no longer function like a ghost runner is supposed to. But we'll change that. Who heard me? That would be the climbers. A group of rebels that tried to oppose Mara. Where are they? Dead, I'm afraid. They'd been killed before I managed to contact you. But there's no time to worry about them now. We're almost done here. Press on. stabbed in the back. We both were, you and I. Who was she? Was? A dear friend. A trusted partner. Brilliant scientist. Who is she now is the question you should be asking. And you would like the answer. No one among the people of Dharma Tower would. I need more answers. And you will get them. For now, Trust me, the Keymaster is your enemy and a tyrant. What do you want me to do? Kill Mara, of course. To be able to do that, you'll have to relearn a few things and tweak your performance. But first, jump. We need to get back, and it's much quicker this way. Located in an old mining tower, we can use it to correct the corrupted parts of your code and hopefully restore your more sophisticated functions. Hopefully. There's no guarantee the data will be intact, but we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. Hmm. Me. In combat, I'm afraid I can't. Cybervoid Remnant is the only medium I can interact with. I will be able to help you with your upgrades once we find the mainframe. Apart from that, just think of me as a voice in your head. One that you should listen to if you want to stay alive. <gasps>
Keymaster Guard is patrolling the area. They may have located the mainframe. Can they use it? No, but they can destroy it, like they did to most of the Cybervoid hardware. This is Zoe Avila of the Climbers. Please, can anybody hear me? Anybody? This is... Ghost Runner. The Ghost Runner? Jack, you're awake! Yes. How? We've been rebuilding you for months. We tried everything we could to wake you up, but you never would. It wasn't up to me. there when they came for us, it would have been different. We might have had a chance. What are you going to do? The fifth is still crawling with keys. Keys? Oh, uh, the Keymaster Guard, bandits and thugs that Mara armed and sent against us. I'm going after her. After the Keymaster? Alone? That's insane. But if anyone can do it, it's definitely you. someone to guide you and keep an eye out for threats. What do you say? Want my help? Yes. Good. I need to move to a safer location and hook up to the network. I'll contact you once I scrounge up some gear. Zoe out. Access remotely. We wouldn't be here if it could. Cyber Void has been fractured, broken into countless disconnected pieces. It's like puddles of water left over after the lake has been drained.
this is it. Jump in. This place again. This place is where we'll find the means to fight our enemy. What do I do? It's in your instincts to navigate the cyber void. In most cases, you'll just have to focus on finding the right direction. Look what these rebels did to your protocols. That's what happens when amateurs mess with perfection. After you're done with this particular jumble of code, you'll gain access to one of a ghost runner's most useful abilities. I need you to start putting in some effort. Luckily, it should come to you naturally. You were born of machine as much as of flesh. Sometimes you will need to close in and attack simultaneously. Let me give you something to aim at. Focus. Visualize yourself in space. Be the motion. Hit them all in a single strike. Good. Once more, take a breath. Picture your destination. Go. No, again. Yes, you got them. The enemies won't line up for you. Adapt to their movements. Sensory boosts give you time to aim. Use it. I see. Moving enemy is too hard a target for you. All right. this technique to cut through projectiles. Give it a try. Very convenient, is it not? Clean up the stragglers and destroy it. We'll be a fine.
These are just bandits loyal to the Keymaster, used by her to keep the base under control. You can expect more competent foes as we move higher up the tower. last of them. Time to get back on track. Where to? Dharma City, of course. We'll need to use Amida Elevator Station. That's the fastest route by far. <laughs> Dharma's foundation in more than one sense. It is the lifeblood of the tower's economy. Back in the Golden Age, there were enough goods produced here to satisfy the needs of all the residents. Of course, the upper levels had certain privileges. During Mara's coup, many of the facilities were damaged. Things have been in slow decline ever since. Nowadays, the area mostly serves as warehouses or gang hideouts, and a reminder of what Dharma used to be. Which is... Home. A safe haven for the survivors of the apocalypse. You built this whole place? I conceived it, designed it, and built it. I am the architect.
Diego said you were all jacked up when he found you, and it stuck. Do you mind if I call you that? No. communications and keep you updated. Atma? Atma chip, the standard neural implant. You must have heard of them. You're going up to Dharma City. Yes. Well, first you have to get through the base, and much has changed since you've been gone. There is no law here anymore, just the Key Master's goons pushing everyone around and shouting orders. We didn't obey. Some of us didn't. You had visited the base often in the past. Towards the end of our time, this place became overrun with criminals. The ghost runners kept them at bay until Mara took over. Produce goes straighter. Your friends? Saul? They weren't afraid to speak up against Mara and remind us that things used to be different. The resistance started because some of us remembered the time before the Keymaster. What is time? Supposedly, she wanted to unlock our chains. Set us free. <laughs> yeah, right. Free from the architect. Probably.
strange. The keys are nearly gone. They're not regrouping at the usual location. They're just retreating. Returning to the city? Not returning. Leaving. Most of the keys are local and never go up there. This is unusual. towards Amada Station. Getting to the elevators is gonna be tricky. Wait. What? Some of their units just changed course. They're... Coming back? Not exactly. Give me a minute. The climbers were always out of their depth, even at full force. Why you believe she can be of help is beyond me. She wants to fight. It takes more than that to be useful. Jack, I've intercepted the key's orders. They're planning to shut down the sector's air filters. What will that do? Toxic dust from the outside will seep inside the tower. Thousands of innocent civilians will die. The entire fifth sector. Which way to the filters? <sighs> Thank you. The air filtering facility is just ahead. Why is Mara do doing this? It's punishment for rebelling against her. She wants to make an example of us, to keep the other sectors in line. Sometimes even your current speed won't be enough. Look for cyber void uplinks to temporarily disable safety limiters and increase acceleration. Use them sparingly, though. You don't want to damage yourself. What are these uplinks? Think of them as loose cables you can grab onto for extra power. Although they can be much more dangerous than electricity.
slowly become lethal. The children and the elderly will get sick first, but eventually it'll kill everyone. Turbines are responsible for internal circulation. It's the big one we have to worry about. For now. Atmosphere. The 
filtering systems were designed to be durable and virtually foolproof. Unless, of course, some fool decides to turn them off. radiation in the air is rapidly increasing. People will soon feel the effects. dust concentration is already 50 times above normal. <laughs> Hold on. Don't worry. Spacers are tough. I'll be fine as long as you bring the filters back online. And so will everyone.
what is Cybervoid? A medium, fabric, that binds all of Dharma's systems together. Or rather, that's what it used to be. Now it's just remnants, slivers of a greater whole. your domain, but I do all the work. I told you, I can't work from your side. There's a barrier between us, a divide that shouldn't be there. And believe me, I'm doing my part. I just don't happen to see it. to adjust. All done. You saved the day. Now you can get back to more important matters. You did it. Thank you, Jack. The people of Sector 5 owe you their lives. I'm so glad we found you. How did you find me? Sheer luck. You were buried in a scrap heap at the bottom of a derelict shaft. You fell a long way, didn't you? Feels like it. The climbers finding you was a one in a million chance. Most other missing ghost runners were located by Mara and destroyed. Most. A few are still unaccounted for. I really wish you'd been there when they came for us. What happened? He surprised us at the hideout. Kicked down the door out of nowhere. Then we ran. I got separated. boarding the elevators to the city. I wish they'd all just... The guys you're fighting are 
are the rear guard. You could wait them out and continue on once they've gone. No need. Um, sure. It's almost scary how little they can do to stop you. Their latest plan is soon. What was your plan? The 
Climbers wanted to take over the elevator and move up to the city. Keys caught us halfway through our preparations. Why did they attack today? The Keymaster must have somehow found out about us. Or about you. We've got a problem. Again? They've just initiated system lockdown at office. slow down their retreat. We could use the climbers' help right about now. Too bad they picked such a poor time to die for their cause. Wasn't it also your cause? They cared for their families. I care for their species. It's a matter of perspective, I suppose. No access to the terminal room from this side of the station, but I guess that's not a problem. Computer genius, but their system begs to be hacked. Besides, Atma makes it easy. A neural implant? Yeah. Everyone had them before the coup. And now? They're not mandatory anymore, but most people have them. station, but getting there will take you hours. You could climb all the way to the sea, but that would require even more time. He's also had these brain chips? Yes, everyone born before the coup. Why? Can they be that? I... no, I don't think so. Not by her.
much time left on the clock. Cybervoid time dilation works in your favor, but you still don't have forever. The elevators will soon be beyond our reach. that the clock is ticking? Hurry it up. This place is impossible to navigate. Good. These firewalls are what's kept me alive for the last 20 years. If you were a regular human, this would make even less sense. Disabled the internal security. Another ghost runner. It could have been you. visualization anyway. How does it work in the real world? Rapid micro vibrations of your inner hydraulics. Sudden change in local pressure will result in a concentrated blast. Let's hope that piece of junk the climbers use to replace your arm can handle it. I 
operation was crowd control, non-lethal force. Of course, there's no need to restrain ourselves now. to reflect projectiles. Give it a try. Elevators are ours. Time to our next target lies in the heart of Dharma City. Elevators were rarely used, even before Mara's revolt. The residents of the base had most of their needs fulfilled right
This is troublesome. How do I disable it? First, you should get on top. You could probably cut it down. It won't hold without the supporting cords. It was no match. Wow. Watching from your perspective, I nearly pissed myself. I'm betting being there in person was a thousand times worse. Yes. I can fool the display panels. While the keys are waiting for you at Upper Amida, I'll redirect the elevator to the maintenance floor above. As long as it gets me closer to Mars. Station is crawling with keys, but it's 
far below you now. Good job. Oh, thank you. You still need to look out for the regular patrol. We thought we were ready. What were you waiting for? You. We thought once you awakened, you'd lead us to victory. Help us break free and avenge the architect. So, what's your plan to defeat the Keymaster? I mean, last time you faced her, you were one of a hundred Ghost Runners. How do you know that? My father. I was only two when the coup happened, but he told me all about it. So many died back then. With all the Ghost Runners gone, there was no one to protect us. Or you can take on the Keymaster by yourself? No. She killed 99 Ghost Runners, and she won't stop until she kills me, too. So you won't stop either until one of you is dead? Yes. I know how you feel. Thank you. 
repository is long gone. Mara has seen to that, but the backup archive still exists. <laughs> What? Whatever we have to do, we'll do. Rebuild the rebellion from the ground up if we have to. engines, air turbines, mining drills, they never stop. There's none of that here.
that during the architect's reign, it was possible to move up here from the base. And then they... Judging from the job she did repairing you, not in a hundred years. full of technology that is all too vulnerable to accidental destruction. With a blade, there are no stray bullets, no shockwaves, no collateral damage. Not... Look at their weapons. 20 years worth of research and no technological progress to speak of. At this rate, Morrow's regime will fall to rebels in a decade or two. Ones armed with sticks and stones. There's some activity near the repository. I can't tell what's going on, but there's a disturbance in the network. What kind of disturbance? There's a field of interference moving through the district. Surveillance systems are going haywire. Some kind of weapon? You're almost at the repository. I wonder what it was like to live in the old world. 
I've heard stories, but I don't know what's true and what isn't. No one does. I mean, how could they? My grandparents were still kids when the gates closed. No human has been outside since.
The data's not there. But the server's intact. Impossible. Unless that interference from earlier was... Get after it!
Who was that? It's your counterpart. Get after it. Surveillance cameras, motion sensors, body scanners. They don't see them. That's why you are called Ghost Runners. I've had it all this time? Of course. How else do you think you've avoided fighting Mara's entire arm all at once?
flawless. Now for the important part. We can scan it for the missing data. It's all in there, intact. Asking for a ranged attack. Here it is. You should be pretty familiar with this technique, considering you've been on the receiving end. Look for the correct angle. Try again. Will this work with any sword? Turu Jiyan weapon. More than swords. They are the pinnacle of engineering. Instruments fine-tuned to the Ghost Runner systems. Yes, it will work with any sword. No. You said projectiles are too unpredictable. Well, you have to plan for contingencies, don't you? That thing. I think that's what was chasing us. Diego, Saul, Elena. Your people. Yes. We didn't know what it was. Yeah. Yes. We didn't know what it was. Just heard the voice. I thought we'd scatter and regroup like always. I... I ran away. It's dead now. They're dead. We're ready. Time for the final assault. To the core. Security is getting much tighter. There are sentry guns ahead. I can't hack them. You need to avoid those turrets. They're deadly. What about my spectral field? The core is protected by much more sophisticated automatic camouflage can only get us so far. They can see me. They can see everything. The core used to house Dharma's technological and administrative centers. Now it's a grim ruin. It's painful seeing my city in such a state of decay. But I've learned my lesson. I won't underestimate Mara again. How can you remember the coup? I was already active when Mara killed Adam.
traversing the exclusion zone. No civilians are allowed beyond here. There are only rumors about the Keymaster's vast laboratory. I've heard she does some terrifying experiments there. I've even heard she sometimes throws people outside. didn't stop us. It was nice of you to pretend you do. 
But we both know you're fine on your own. Do you have a weapon? I do. Thank you for everything. Saving humanity will take more than just killing the tyrant. It will require iron resolve and a single unified will. Most of humanity's history and culture is forever lost. Mara didn't care about such things. The only science she prized was her own research. She had no idea how to run the tower. While everything fell apart, she hid away in her laboratory. What was her goal? Change. She took it upon herself to alter humanity. see for yourself soon enough. Why? She doesn't do speeches. Never been much of a leader. It's been a long time since I've talked to you.
This place is not our home. Opportunity. The technique you'll learn here is beyond what regular ghost runners were ever capable of. Regular? We weren't equal? Equal? Yes. Identical? No. Some of you had unique abilities. Some had experimental features. destined to become so very special. Who were we? We've been through that already. You were peacekeepers. My elite... No, before that. Before the implants. There was no before. You weren't born. You are engineered from a single cell up. You don't have implants. You are your implants.
Mike, do you remember the Atma chip the girl used? Brain interfaces. Yes. There's a way to exploit them. Send a control signal deep into the neural cortex. You learned how to hack people. If that's what you want to call it. try to use this exploit? No, she won't. She doesn't even know it exists. Ironic. Considering the way she defeated you, I guess we both kept our little secrets.
software update is complete. Now, to try it out, find their center. Let the implants speak to you. Pick your target wisely. Not every pawn is going to be worth the effort. Just like that. This is actually quite tricky to simulate. You're worse than Mara. What are you talking about? She sabotaged the Ghost Runners. You did it to everyone. It's a tool. If you don't like it, don't use it. Thank <laughs> you. 
Deformation is not the worst of Mara's tortures. Their minds are removed from its original form. What about your mind?
survival or to the plan. You will learn all the details once we deal with Mara. She is the only enemy.